I studied engineering at university because I was okay at maths and physics and I wanted to be an engineer. I loved engineering at university but I wanted a form of engineering that would be fast moving and challenging and be a really strong team environment so it was fairly natural for me to seek a form of it that was a sporting based engineering challenge and being a big fan of F1 as a boy uh, that was where I first sought my career and I joined straight from university and have done nothing else since until this venture. Coming into this world as someone familiar with Formula One, it's quite dizzying how much the design space is broad and unexplored compared with F1. In F1 we have rule changes year to year, but the changes are actually quite small compared to America's Cup where the campaigns are sort of three, four years apart. The space that you need to explore, the number of variables that, that are there in the design challenge, really large and we would be completely lost if it weren't for the fact that this team has a broad range of very seasoned America's Cup engineers who are able to sort of guide the team through that design space, only spending the effort in the areas that are likely to give us performance on the boat. I have just spent the last 24 hours this wonderful place, the Royal Yacht Squadron here, with history and tradition flowing out of every pore of this building. Um, but it was pretty clear that there is, there is a sort of weeping sore uh, in that building, and that is that the America's Cup has never actually sat there, held by this yacht club, and that it would be an enormous deal if it were bought here. And I know from my perspective, that it will feel absolutely fantastic because I can see already how, how tough it is, how hard it will be for us to get everything right on time. But I also am thrilled by the prospect of doing so and looking forward to playing my part and putting my shoulder to that wheel along with all my colleagues to try and get everything right so that we can bring that cup here and, uh, and place it uh, in the building alongside all the other history and tradition of this building and, uh, and I think that will be just a fantastic experience for all of us.